Welcome to September's Diabetes Technology Report. In this video, I'll get you up to speed on what happened in the diabetes technology world over the last month. And this includes... Sonovo announced third generation of their tubeless insulin pump. Should the Omnipod be worried? Also, some T-Slim news. T-Slim Mix 2 is coming to the UK. Also, Tandem Team is working on the tubeless version of the T-Slim X2 called T-Sport. This and so much more is coming your way. Let's kick things off with new diabetes management system from Cellnovo. Third generation system uses Android lockdown device to communicate with small tubeless pod. The only noticeable difference between generation 2 and generation 3 is the controller which is much sleeker and phone like because it is a phone, a locked down Android phone. Generation 3 system uses Bluetooth to communicate similarly to the Omnipod Dash. Company states that this lays a groundwork for future integration with wireless devices like glucose meters or continuous glucose monitors. The device has already been used by early adopters and Sonovo is expecting fast global adoption after this year's EACD. Over to some tandem news now, they have signed a distribution agreement with this company. <laughs> to bring the T-Slim X2 to the UK. T-Slim X2 is not yet available but should be by the end of the year. This pump has not yet been added to the MHS pump list but that is likely to change relatively soon. Now T-Sport, the tubeless version of the T-Slim X2. Now this is not a sweet gossip video but let's just have a look at the tubeless version of the T-Slim X2. This pump is expected to launch in 2020 with Control IQ, which is the give more insulin when high and give less insulin when low system. Just to clarify, this pump is still in product development, but is expected to be approved by 2020 because it will be submitted as a tubeless version of the T-Slim X2, so new clinical studies will not be necessary. More international news, Libre Link App has just been approved in Canada. This app fully replaces your freestyle reader. Libre Link in Canada is available for iPhone and Android smartphones. To find out more about Libre Link and how it works, check my Libre Link video linked in the description and in the eye. Now, one is an older video of mine, so don't expect me to be in the studio and don't expect that audio quality. And so that's it. See, September is one of those dead months in diabetes technology. Summertime is very packed. Companies are launching new products. Um, things are happening and then in October, November, loads of conferences um, and things that happen in Arizona. But September is kind of quiet, so that's it. Also, you might have noticed that I haven't uploaded a single video in one month and this is because I've been working on my Freestyle Libre vs Dexcom 6 video. This video has been very time consuming, um, a lot more than I expected and so my entire YouTube effort has been has been put into that. So um, that video, I'm expecting to publish it within a week. I am on final stages of editing as of when I'm recording this video. Also, I've got a question. So for a while now, for about two months, I've considered, I've been thinking about creating a written, certainly written blog, like an actual blog, and posting my video scripts on there. So in case you don't know, for every single video that I do, I write a script and I read it. Um, in front of my camera. That's basically what I do. Um, I like to think that my videos are quite informative. Well, I hope they are. Um, and by writing a script, I can triple check that all of my facts are accurate, that I've got evidence for every single thing that I talk about. And at the beginning, I would just talk randomly to camera and, and, and then I would be like, oh, why did I say that? That's not true. And so by writing scripts, I, I, like to, I can control what I'm saying um, and make sure it's all factually accurate. And so, would you like me to just post those scripts on a blog? I mean, it would be a four-minute job for me because I write those scripts anyway, so it wouldn't make a, a difference uh, to me. Also, I would probably do some original other content on there. So, some things I see online and I think, oh, that's very interesting, you know, in the diabetes technology space. But it's definitely not worth doing a video about it because it's not as, as, as important and so would you like me to do that let me know in the comments um i am split i really don't know and if if, if there is if you guys like it the idea then i will do it um and so that's that thanks so much for watching and see you in a couple of days for my libre versus g6 video see you guys
Bye-bye.